seven must-see astronomical events in the August 2023 night sky. Planets, asteroids, and meteors, oh my! August is one of the best night months of the year for astronomical events. This is primarily due to the Perseides, arguably the best meteor shower of the year. But the Perseides aren't the only thing worth seeing in the night sky this month. The August night sky has plenty else to see. August 1st. In August 2023, there will be two supermoons and a blue moon. The first supermoon, called the Sturgeon Moon, will peak on August 2nd, and the blue moon will be visible on August 31st. What is a supermoon? At its closest point, known as perigee the distance decreases to approximately 363, 300 km, the full moon appears larger and brighter than usual. When to watch the celestial event? August will showcase two full moons, both of which will be supermoons. The first one, known as the Sturgeon Moon, will peak on August 2nd at 12.01 a.m. Indian time. The name Sturgeon Moon comes from some Native American groups, particularly those in the Great Lakes region. The second full moon, a blue moon, will be visible on August 31st, reaching its peak at 7.05 a.m. Indian time. This particular blue moon will also be a supermoon, making it the closest full moon to Earth for the entire year. August 3rd, Close Approach of the Moon and Saturn August kicks off with a series of planetary viewing opportunities. There are, of course, a number of other interesting deep space objects to see, and a few meteor showers that will peak later in the month. A bright and nearly full waxing gibbous moon, 92% illuminated, will be visible just 2 degrees 15 minutes from Saturn. Both can be seen with the unaided eye, though using a telescope or binoculars will help you see Saturn's rings and look more closely at the beautiful face of the Moon. August 8th, Close Approach of the Moon and Jupiter It's hard to believe how far apart Jupiter and Saturn are in the night sky, after their great conjunction almost two years ago. Whereas these two planets used to have close approaches with the Moon in close succession, they're now occurring almost a week apart. As Saturn has already taken its turn in August, it's now Jupiter's time to have close approach in the night sky. In the early morning hours of August 8th, the Moon and Jupiter will appear just 2 degrees 39 minutes apart, and you can easily hop between them with your eyes or your favorite stargazing equipment should you decide to stay up late to see them at their closest. August 13th, Peak of the Perseid Meteor Shower if you love the night sky, you already know what makes the night of August 13th so special, it's the peak of the Perseides. The Perseides meteor shower peaks every year in mid-August, in 2023, this peak is expected to occur overnight on the 13th. At its peak, you can expect to see up to 150 meteors per hour. This, combined with warm weather in the northern hemisphere, makes it the most popular meteor shower of the year. The Perseides meteor shower is caused when the Earth passes through a stream of debris left by the comet 109P slash Swift Tuttle. August 18th Zero Shadow Day What is Zero Shadow Day on August 18th? This celestial phenomenon takes place twice a year and all vertical objects stop casting shadows on the ground. The next such celestial phenomenon will take place in Bengaluru on August 18th. Zero shadow day occurs when the sun will be directly overhead at local noon, and hence any vertical object will cast no shadow. Bengaluru is witnessing zero shadow day on zero shadow day is celestial phenomenon wherein vertical objects won't have any shadow for a brief period of time, according to multiple reports. In Bengaluru, zero shadow day will take place around 12.17 pm. August 18th, peak of the Kappa Signet meteor shower. The second meteor shower in August will occur on the night of August 18th. On this night, you can look for the peak of the Kappa Signet meteor shower at a rate of roughly 3 meteors per hour. This meteor shower is not as bombastic as the Perseides a few days earlier, and the moon will still be about 50% illuminated on this night. To spot Kappa Signet meteors, look for the constellations of Draco near Cygnus, with its distinctive cross asterism. On the 18th, Kappa Signet meteors will appear to radiate from this area of the sky, high above the northeastern horizon. 
August 27th, Saturn at opposition. August starts off quietly, but with one major astronomical event worth seeing, Saturn will be at opposition on the night of August 27th. What does this mean? For those not familiar with the term, it means that Saturn will be directly opposite from the Sun in the sky, or that the Earth is exactly lined up with the Sun on one side and Saturn on the other. This means that from our perspective on the night of the first, Saturn in the night sky will be brightly illuminated by the Sun shining on the Earth's daytime side. It's a great night to try and see Saturn. The Moon will be 85% illuminated on this night, so be sure to check a night sky app to understand where the Moon will be before you pull out your telescope or astronomical binoculars to try and spot Saturn and its lovely rings. August 30th, Close Approach of the Moon and Saturn Rounding out the series of planetary conjunctions this month, the Moon and Saturn will again appear close in the evening sky on August 30th. If you enjoyed watching the video, do give us a like, also share the same with astronomy lovers. And subscribe to our channel, Secrets of Space, for astronomy updates. Thank you for watching.